Hello YouTube. I'm going to make a video on a couple different um, wallpaper apps you could get for your Android phone. This is the um, LG Optimus through Virgin Mobile. Um, the first app I'm going to show you is called Backgrounds. And it's pretty simple to use. Um, this is, these are some picture frame um, wallpapers. You could put any picture inside where the little checkers are. And you, or let's see, you can have, um, I believe um, when you first open the program, it, you, um, it brings up the most recent wallpapers, um, but you do have categories, lots of categories to choose from. Um, I don't know, music, and it loads up, loads up pretty quick. But you can just choose whichever wallpaper you want, and it has options across the top to set the wallpaper. Um, set it as a contact, set it uh, as a favorite, or to save it to your phone. And it's it's a really good app. I like it a lot, and it's really simple to use. So number two is Flicky Wallpapers. And this one is back. It's a little bit more graphic than um, than the background app. It it pretty much actually looks a lot like the gallery on the phone. It's a little bit more animated. Um, but once again, you just pick whichever wallpaper you want. If you like touch down in the corner here, yeah, you can zoom in on it. So here you go. You get a little option. Save it. You can see a slideshow of the wallpapers. You can set it as the wallpaper on your phone. Let's see. Zoom in and out. Um, share it. Record it. You know. But um. It's also a really nice app. They have a lot of nice wallpapers in here. And they do have categories. If you go to hit your menu, key, I don't know if you've seen it pop up at the bottom there. It says sort categories and more. Here's categories. 3D, people, graffiti, music, patterns, space, movies, abstract, games, holidays, nature, you know, technology, military, animals, pets, a lot. A lot to choose from. I do um, recommend that. That's a great wallpaper app as well. Um, the, oops, sorry, the wrong thing there. Um, the next one I'm going to do is a simple one. It's called Colors. And it's basically just plain colors as your black background. And you could pick from any color that's on here. Go to the next page. And then also there's this little, let's see, it says pick, and you could make, you know, your own color and set it as your background. It's a very simple app, but if you just want a plain color as your background, this is great. It has pretty much any color you can think of. Um, it's great. I recommend it. Next, well, i got one more on here to show you. And that is Zedge. I'm sorry, I'm trying to show you these icons, but my camera's just not focusing very well. 
And you can also get ringtones on this app, but we're just going to do wallpapers. We want to go home. And um, this is great. It, it automatically brings up the featured wallpapers. You just scroll through. You can make them, um, if you click the little heart, it makes them a favorite. Um, you can download them to your phone, or you could just set it as a wallpaper. So you just touch one that you like, and it brings it up. And if you see down here, the little arrow is the download button. So if you push the download, you see, and then you get like a blinking circle. You push the circle to set it as your wallpaper. Um, if you touch the heart, see it turned red. That means it went into your favorites, and then you have a little envelope if you want to send it to somebody. But it's a pretty cool app. I like Sedge a lot, and it has, like I said, you can get ringtones on this as well, or um, text notifications. Um, uh, they have a lot of cool stuff on there. So I definitely recommend that. It's a great app. Um, if you have any questions, if there's any um, other apps that you want me to review, um, be free to leave it in the comments. Thank you.